All right, hey guys, welcome to a short little guide on Archie Steam Farm version 3.0.1.6. If you are unfamiliar with Archie Steam Farm, this is the best Steam trading card farming program out there. This will let you idle all of your games and get all of the card drops in a relatively short amount of time. Unfortunately, with the newest version of Archie Steam Farm, they have completely changed the way the configuration is set up. So my previous tutorial on this matter is a little bit outdated at this point. So I'm making an updated version. So I'll be going a little bit faster. Um, um, just try to stick with me. I'll go through the entire setup. What you want to do is click on the first link in the description below. It'll send you to the latest release. Scroll all the way down and click on ASF Windows X64 if you're using 64-bit of Windows. Wait for that to download. Once that's finished downloading, just open it up. And then what you want to do is you want to drag all of these files into an empty folder on your desktop or wherever you want it installed. So I'm just going to drag this over. And once that's done, just open it up and you'll see a ton of files here. It's a little bit confusing, but just bear with me. Scroll down and you'll see a application that says Archie Steam Farm. Right click it and create a new shortcut. So create shortcut. Once that's done, drag that onto your desktop. We'll be using that a little bit later. And scroll up, you'll see a bunch of folders here. Click on the one that says config and there'll just be three files in here. This will, this will be where we put our config files for all of our um, Steam accounts. So going back to this website here, the second link in the description will be below will talk a little bit about how to set up the new config file. Kind of confusing, but once you get to here, just open the ASF config generator page, which is right over here. And then what you want to do, you'll start out on this home page. Just click on bot. And this is the new way to set up your Steam accounts. It's kind of strange typing in your Steam login information on a website, but this website does not save any of your info. So I believe it's completely safe to use. But all you need to do is type in a name of your farm. So I'm just going to do like farm or farm one, doesn't really matter. And then my Steam login and my Steam password. And then scrolling down, you just want to click ch this checkbox that says enabled and then click download. That's pretty much all you have to do. This is completely optional, but if you want some additional features, you can click on toggle advance. One of my favorite features is the farm offline. Just hit this check mark. And basically when the card farming program is running on Steam, it'll just show that you are online instead of being in a game and constantly hopping between games because friends would constantly message me and be like, what game is that? What are you playing? What are you doing? Why are you constantly? constantly switching between games and I would constantly have to tell them that I'm just farming trading cards. If you click this farm on offline option, basically you'll be farming trading cards without it showing that you're um, playing the games, which I think is super useful. Anyways, scrolling down, once you get all that finished, you can just hit download and then you'll download a file called farm.json. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just take this other file that I created earlier. And what you wanna do is you wanna go back to the card farm and go to that config folder that I showed you uh, initially and then drag the new file that you downloaded, the farm.json or whatever you titled the bot. And uh, yeah, you just drag that into the config folder and now you're pretty much set up and ready to go. Just go ahead and launch Archie Steam Farm, the shortcut that we created initially. It'll give you this like warning message that says, please review our privacy policy section on the wiki if you're concerned about what ASF is and what it's in fact doing. You just wanna wait here for about 30 seconds to a minute and it'll go through some additional dialogue um, in a second. And once that's done, it'll say, please enter your 2A, 2FA code from your Steam Authenticator app. That's the two-factor authentication from your mobile phone. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. And as you can see, once you enter in your two-factor authentication, it'll say logging in to Steam, and then it'll tell you exactly how many cards you have left to idle. For me, it says two weeks, one day, and 13 hours remaining because I have a lot of games. Let's see. Let's see if it'll tell me. Yeah, a total of 202 games, 719 cards will take about two weeks, one day, and 13 hours. So essentially from this point on, all I have to do is click on this little shortcut. And once once this starts running, it'll start um, farming the trading cards. And I can just leave this idly by. I can minimize it and do other things and just have this open whenever my computer is on. And I will constantly be getting Steam trading card drops. And I can sell those cards or I can use them to craft badges in the future. So that's about it. I hope this has helped you. I'm sorry if I went a little bit fast. You can just slow down the video and go at your own pace. But that's just a quick overview on the new version of... Archie Steam Farm. I hope you found this useful. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.